What's going on guys? Welcome back to Sneaky Games, a slide to Ben these Let's Play here on my YouTube channel, Swirly Games. Last time we made our final preparations to get ready for Operation Canada Games. It is now time to participate in John Bisson's Lumberjack Games. So we've got some plans in place to cheat in this uh <laughs> in these games because honestly John Bisson's is too good of a lumberjack. Like we can't beat him in his own game, so we gotta even the odds however way we can, even if they're not the most honest of starts. So I checked, and Bentley's the one who started us off, starts us off here. So let's get right into it. Okay, guys, let's head down there and win those talents from Jean Bisson. Sly, try to keep a low profile when we get close. We don't want him to recognize you. I was gonna say that should not be good. Okay. Excuse me, sir. We humble lumberjacks would like to participate in your lumberjack game. Lumberjack game. You got what it takes to win the clockwork talons, eh? Well, I'm sure enough gonna let you play, so long as you pay the entry fee. Much obliged, partner. We'll uh, just take our positions for the competition. Hmm. Enjoy the Entry fee. while you think you still got a chance. It's as close to winning as you'll ever get. This year's okay. first event will be a power chopping contest. All right. Not like anyone's ever going to beat my record, but let them try. Oh, damn. Not good. I suck. Not bad, hippo. But watch and learn. Destroy that log without even breaking a sweat. Okay. Hey, you did your job, Murray. Okay, Bentley, you're on. Plant the eagle egg on Basson, and the angry eagle mm. parent should swoop in and throw off his axe timing. All right. Okay. Where's these damn eagles show up? I tried sprinting. I was like, why can't I run? What a dumb way to run. I can't use my turtle sprint either. I can't jump at all. This is so stupid. Alright, well now I know. Okay. Bobbin and we Fuck! Getting close, getting close. Alright, we made it to this point. Finally. Why are these going drifting back and forth? Does anyone know? Okay, we had plenty of time actually too. Which is funny. Alright, we made it, finally. Jeez. So why would they actually give him that? What? I think you better See? rethink them scores, boys. Think them but scores, boy. It was perfect tens, right? I'm like, yep, yeah, mm, 100%. 10 out of 10. You know what? It's actually an 11. So your pink friend knows how to handle an axe. Let's see how you handle a vertical wall of ice. This used to drive me insane growing up before I, or while growing up, because I didn't understand. You leave it held down. I thought you had to like time it right. Oh. With that performance, you shouldn't have even bothered showing up. Literally me not jumping on the beginning, like being able to get the jump there, screwed me over. J grab the fucking thing! Jesus. God, that was so much harder than it needed to be. Alright, now we gotta shoot the grappling hooks at him. 
This should be Murray doing it. There we go. Oh, that's why they were there. You will need to hook it with all three lines to pull them off the wall. Perfect. That landed on him? Whoa. Well, this one's got no chance. Now that's how it's done. Okay. Okay. Got him there. Got him there. Final one more. Way too high. Get him. Alright, we got him at the very end. Ah! Pfft. That's a zero. These ducks. They're asking for it now. It seems you have pulled the wrong cards again. Did I ever tell any of you the story about the judge from last year's competition who mistakenly gave me a score other than 10? <laughs> oh, yep. Right away, sir. My, my mistake. I see we're tied with only one event to go. Unfortunately for you, I've saved my best event for the last. Mm. Spinning log competition. Okay, looks All easy right. enough. I just need to stay out of the water. Oh, they all sink. There's really not even any like movement needed. Oh god. Well, apparently there is. Got me there, Zombie Song. Okay. Now we're almost, like, just now halfway. Lovely. Oh, boy. Okay. I'm gonna try to stay middle at all times if possible. Oh. Guess wrong there. There it is, to 10 out of 10. Nice. So I gotta grease the logs or something? This is crazy. John Besson's got those judges so intimidated, there's no way he can lose. You're right, Murray. Those guys need to go. Yes. Okay, I'm just making this up on the fly, but what if I were to lure the judges one by one into that cave? Once inside, you two will knock them out and take their clothes. Genius. When all they look just like ducks. Bed restrained, we'll be able to don our disguises and take their place at the judges' table. Sly, you can use the alarm clock gadget to distract mm. the judges and lure them into the cave. Perfect. That's a great plan, Sly. But you'll have to move fast. Once John Desson finishes the log rolling event, the gig is up. Yep. And there he's got his clockwork talents. They equipped it for me. I think that would still be there. Alright, so it's on L2. Will they come back? Okay, that is close enough. Alright, that should be right there. They go in there? Perfect. Alright, attaboy, Bentley. Okay. Easy peasy. Could be close enough. Oh yeah, I rolled right in there. What? 
Okay, why did I have to do that twice? Perfect. Got plenty of time. Plenty of time, even if it glitches out on us again. And the final throw. Did they go too far? Where's the perfect... Okay, I was like, what the hell, man? That's three throws I put there. Yep, just look, we look just like them. Alright. Oh! <laughs> Good guy, you just killed him. Oh, my aching head. Those talons really pack a punch. I would have sliced your aching heads off. Murray! Wake up! Yeah, I'm awake, but not so loud. Ooh. I have a splitting headache. Yeah. What? Where are we? What's going on? This looks like the sawmill control room. Bison must have thrown us in here for interrogation later. I, for one, would like to escape before he returns. It looks like we're pretty well sealed in here. Unless... Unless what? Unless you can fit through that hole. I... I think I could squeeze through there. I'll drop huh. down and try to free you guys from the outside. If there's any trouble, I'll call with this walkie-talkie. You might be able to help me with these sawmill controls. Huh. While you guys do that, I'll try prying open that steel door. Given enough time, I might be able to make some progress. Okay. Everyone's got a job to do, it sounds like. Sounds like a plan. Good luck, Bentley. And remember to shout if I can help you from up here. Okay. You okay? I can't see you from in here, but I heard the fall. I'll be fine. Just give me a moment to catch my breath. Not good. Oh, candy britches. Candy britches. I should have figured a puny turtle like you'd find a rat hole to squirm through. Well, I just dropped my glasses, had to come pick them up. I hmm. ain't like you, boy. I I has there been a Bentley been boss fight yet? I don't think so. Paid a visit to your hideout and found all them clockwork parts. Lucky thing, too. Arpeggio is That's willing right. to plunk down a king's ransom for the whole lot. I even threw in the talons. You sold all the clockwork parts? Why didn't they destroy them when they got them? Has them all? I wouldn't expect one of your kind to understand. The That's big. Stupid to know a wood Stupid. A wood That's it. Time I showed you just how stupid. Stupid. Really are. All right. Sly, on my command. I hear you. Prepare yourself, Bison. On guard. On guard. Okay, Walnut. Get ready for a smushing. Call out which lever I should pull. Sauce, sauce. There you go. Okay. I've got myself with it because I'm an idiot. There we go. Keep the saws coming. Okay. Cook em, boys. There we go. Doing all right so far. Couple 
more hits. All right. Pretty low so far. Nothing bad right now. Oh, God. Ooh, ah. Right, each one's getting them now. It's pretty fucked up. You're trying to kill me, bro? One more saw should get him. Got him. Tarnation. I've been done in by some four eyed turtle. Four eyed turtle. Times have changed. Once again, Braids triumph over Broad. Hell oh, yeah. They're out. Good job, little buddy. That was some fast thinking. Don't forget about me. You too, bud. Did a great job opening that door, Murray. Thanks. Uh, attention, uh, John Besson. Arpeggio's uh, carrier blimp will uh, arrive to pick up the Northern Light battery in exactly one minute. Okay, enough patting ourselves on the back. If we're going to get the clockwork parts back, we need to get onto that blimp. The silo battery isn't far. If we run, we can make it. Enough talk, let's move! Get to running. Cutscene? Or do we actually have to run? Shake a leg that blimps on its way. We all know about Bentleys. Oh my god. Super speed. Okay. Chuck him up there. Oh, he's... I didn't do any of that. The game did it for me. It's weird that it put the arrow on it. And here's the big bad blimp. Oh, man, you guys. 84%. As we shut ourselves into the Northern Light battery, it became black. For a few long minutes, we just sat there in darkness. No one dared to talk for fear that John Bassan's men might discover where we were hiding. Time seemed to have stopped. And then, we felt it. We were being we lifted up to Arpeggio's blimp. Oh man, I remember the blimp it was now. so strange. The focus of all our schemes had been stolen from us. Our clockwork parts were gone. Looking around the inside of the battery, I knew we all felt it. Failure. I was twitchy and ready for action. Any action. Bentley tried to make some sense of the situation by drawing up meaningless plans. But Murray? Murray took it the worst. He oh, just sat guy. there sobbing while the team van floated away over the horizon. That van was his life. I knew I'd have to find a way to make it up to him. A poor, poor van. Poor man in his van. Alright, you guys. That's a familiar face. I wonder if he'll show up. Probably not. But, let's see what episode 8's called. Anatomy for Disaster. Oh, man. So, episode 7. Menace in the North has been completed. I believe this is it. I believe episode 8 is the finale of this game. So we have come a long way. This is part 30 somehow. So it's probably going to be like 33, 34 for us to wrap this thing up. So I don't want to give any promises. But if all goes to plan, should be doing something special for this episode 8. The finales of the, the last couple episodes of Slide 2, my favorite game of all time. So hopefully I can figure out how. It's mostly a how. And then we'll be good to go. So... Hope you guys will like what we do for that. I'm super excited and I'll be very sad if I can't do it, but I'm confident enough that I'm at least talking about it. If I wasn't, I just wouldn't say anything. So tomorrow, hopefully you're seeing a very cool, very different video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please share, like, and subscribe. Follow me on Twitter at Games. While you're at it, if you could share this video with the hashtag SlyCooper2020. Try to let Sony know that we need to let Sanzari Games make Sly5 after all these years. 
give us that long-awaited fifth entry in the series. Listen to my dad, and I'll see you in the next video.